how important is it for an artist and a producer to have a relationship during the creation of a song when they're trying to develop a new sound for an artist? Uh, you know, I, I could I could sit here and say it's it's essential and critical, but realistically, a lot of artists have broken through um, by recording to beats that were just the right beat and they may have never even met the producer. So for example, Old Town Road, right? Um, uh, Lil Nas X and Kiyo hadn't met until the song was already done and had already started uh, building momentum on its own. So granted, once things started taking off, they linked up and they communicated, but they were in, in different continents. So I think it's absolutely possible to make great music in the age of the internet and the age of, of um, online beat leasing and all that um, without ever being in the same room or maybe even not exchanging uh, an email. Like maybe you're just exchanging pure creative energy. Um, but if there's an artist that you as a producer, this is advice for producers. Um, if there's an artist that you as a producer believe in and think, um, is talented, then if, if you get an opportunity to work with them, that's when you really start going beyond just making the beat and you get into production. And if nothing else, it's really fun and, and really fulfilling. Um, but it's always nice to have that talent. Uh, when you walk into a session, you, you're more marketable as a producer who makes beats than just a, a beat maker. Um, so it's fun, but I'm not going to tell anyone what to do because you can win in any lane that you choose. 